What's up, good people? Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Jokey Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Hope you guys are having a great Monday. Hope it's a move on Monday, because we're moving on from that loss that we can't do jack shit about. And getting ready for the Philadelphia Eagles on Christmas Eve. Um, we do actually have some good news. Um, Leighton Van Der Esch, when we saw the hit that he took, um, knowing that he's had neck issues and hearing that he had a neck uh, injury, um, you'd start thinking, is this it for Leighton Van Der Esch um, as far as his career goes? Um, Stephen Jones is actually reporting that, or saying on 105.3 The Fan a few minutes ago, that Leighton Van Der Esch's uh, injury is a shoulder stinger. It's the shoulder, uh, basically a stinger is you basically get hit and it's like literally just kind of numbs the whole thing and all that. I had a, a shoulder stinger that literally just made my arm go limp uh, for about a week. Um, so that's actually good news that it is not a neck injury uh, because he has had several neck injury issues to deal with. So, good news at least on that front. Uh, maybe we'll be able to get him back sooner than later. But uh, at this point, um, with what's left to the regular season, the regular season, we're pretty much locked in at the number five spot. I mean, unless the Eagles implode, and I have to give the Eagles credit because the Eagles have played well and have been consistent throughout the season. I don't expect that to happen. Um, the only place we have is, I mean, it would have to be the Giants would have to win everything and we'd have to lose everything to lose any playoff position. So the focus right now needs to be the Cowboys becoming the best team that they can be first week of playoffs. And that's getting healthy, getting an attitude, and finding a winning formula. All right, peace.